judges, I request you to give a prize, please. Okay. On, on live camera in front of everybody. If IFPB does not give a prize to one of those winners, just like they said, I will sue every single one of you. Very simple. If November wasn't weird enough, this weekend was definitely the way to wrap it up. Having judges getting slapped at contests, now judges walking out of contests entirely. This weekend, there was a Shiru Classic, which we did a review of. However, there was also an amateur event, not by Shiru. This was just associated with the Dubai Fitness Expo. It's very possible that this promoter doesn't really understand the sports of bodybuilding or just how deep the politics of it do go. So this isn't necessarily unexpected and it could just be by sheer accident. I don't think it was necessarily an intentional assault of the IPB. Arif Mirza attempted to have a actor, a regional actor, associated with the conflicting organization present the award to the overall winner. Because of this person's association with a conflicting organization, that's why you hear the promoter saying, there's no politics here in Dubai. No politics in Dubai. No politics in Dubai. No that is when the judges were walking out of the building, and this is because they knew he was associated with the rival organization, and it was taken as a sign of disrespect. The promoter himself gives out an award. However, these standings wouldn't stay, as a few days later, the official judges would give their overall winner, which was different from his. This would go to Adi Chopin, who just a few days later would come in second place behind Roly Winkler at the Dubai she Ru Classic. And while he'd already qualified apparently for professional status earlier in the season, this was his second time qualifying this year. And presumably the guy who was awarded champion by the promoter did not actually win the contest, so he's no longer qualified for pro status. That also just goes to show you how dense some of these amateur contests internationally are getting and how competitive they are. It used to be the NPC USA's and Nationals were the cream of the crop, and they still are, but we're getting more and more depth in these international lineups, and when you're seeing the physiques get awarded for it. And in just a weekend, we've seen a guy go from amateur winner to getting second place at a very competitive post-Olympia contest as an IFBB pro. So that's it for today, guys. We also have a review of this contest in our previews. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe. I'm Waylon Martin with Bodybuilding.News. 